My name is Dwan Kelsey and I'm a nurse practitioner with Well Life, a diabetes clinic and educational resource center located in Raleigh, North Carolina. And we want to discuss today diet treatments for the diabetic. Some diet recommendations that I would recommend for a diabetic. One will be to decrease processed foods as much as possible, to decrease the anything that's already pre-made, that's already come into a box, that already comes in a microwavable form, we need to decrease those. We need to decrease our canned foods. Anything that's canned now is fresh or frozen. So get it fresh or frozen. Do not get it in the can um, form, especially vegetables. No canned vegetables uh, whatsoever. So decrease the processed food. Two, I would decrease the, I would recommend that they decrease the fat intake. So watch the fat intake, watch eating out is where we consume most of our fat. So I will recommend cooking at home as much as possible. Now you have to come up with what works best for you and your family. So is that a crock pot meal? Is that a 30 minute meal? Um, is that meal planning on Saturday, sitting down on Saturday saying this is what we're eating Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday? Whatever works for your family, we have to implement that particular action in order for you to eat and cook more at home. The other thing I would say is to decrease the um, sugar intake in our beverages. So we cannot consume um, soda pop or any type of soda. Be very careful with fruit juices. I actually do not even recommend diet drinks because diet drinks, no, they don't have any fat, no, they don't have any carbs, but they do have sodium in it. And so when we talk about a patient that has diabetes, oftentimes we're also talking about a patient that has high blood pressure who needs to decrease their sodium intake. So I recommend water. If you're gonna do fruit juices, you wanna make sure that you're doing it where it's a 100% juice, not just the, the um, fruit flavored juices or the fruit beverages. Um, you will want to consume 100% um, juice. The other thing is to increase whole grains and whole vegetables. We got to increase green leafy vegetable, collards, spinach, kale, turnips, broccoli, cabbage. We have to increase those in our diets. We have to increase fiber, which can be beans, um, don't forget about the black beans, the red beans, the lima beans, the butter beans. Very good source of protein, very good source of fiber. Stay away from white, um, white foods like white rice, white bread, white pasta. And even with the pasta, the rice, and the potatoes and all those, decrease those to about, got to remember our portion sizes. So no more than a handful. So if it's greater than the palm of your hand, then it's probably too much food. So use your hand as a guide. If it's greater than the palm of your hand, then it's probably too much food. And I will also say increase your water intake because water helps to flush out sh um, sugar in the blood, helps to di at least dilute it. So increase the water intake. Diabetes is a very complex disease. This has just been basic information regarding diabetes. Please be sure to visit your medical provider for more information or for diagnosis of diabetes.